Off the top here at 5 o'clock tonight, we have some new information on this deadly crash in Devons. I-Team sources tell WBZ there's evidence that the driver deliberately drove into a behavioral health center. That crash killed the driver of that truck. Thank you for joining us. I'm David Wade. And I'm Lisa Hughes. I-Team sources also tell WBZ there may be a link between the driver and this facility. WBZ's Christina Rex is live in Devons. And Christina, the damage limited there to the front of that building. Yeah, absolutely, Lisa and David. While that driver was killed, this was very lucky for the patients and the people working inside. I want to show you here behind me. Crews are still here patching everything up, but we're told it was really just that front facade of the building that was hit and damaged. But otherwise, the building's structurally sound, as investigators still work to figure out exactly why this happened. A truck just smashed into the building. It is on fire. A pickup truck through a mental hospital rattled this area in Devon's Wednesday morning. Investigators say someone drove directly into the front of Terra Vista Behavioral Health Center around 5.30 in the morning. The truck then burst into flames and the driver died. Well, I'm really sad about that. Uh, you know, hope, you know, who, who knows what he was think, thinking. Sources tell the I-team they have evidence this was deliberate and that the driver had a loved one who was treated at this facility, which focuses on acute psychiatric care for kids and adults. The truck crashed right through the front offices, which were empty at the time. It hit the administrative offices uh, and uh, did not in any way, shape or form damage any of the patient rooms. CEO Francis uh, Savageau uh, says the hospital was at full capacity before the crash, but no one inside was hurt. The folks that were here in the building when this took place at 536 did an outstanding job. Our, uh, the, our administrative nurse that's in charge of the building at that hour of the night uh, responded absolutely um, by the book. You, I couldn't ask for more. David Laguerre drives people to and from the facility. He came by for work this morning and was sad to find out a place that helps so many may have been deliberately targeted. You know, I brought a lot, a lot of people home that were well, and I brought a lot, a lot of people home that were were well. So, you know, it's just the mental health state of the pe pe people around in, in the state today. Uh, there's going to be more uh, me mental health facilities out, out there. There aren't enough. And as far as hospital operations goes, the hospital did not accept any new patients today, but otherwise operated as normal. They say they'll start accepting new patients again, hopefully by tomorrow. Now, at this time, the Worcester County District Attorney has not yet released the name of that driver. Live in Devons, Christina Rex, WBZ News. Christina, thank you.